If you want to check out a cool cocktail that's got amaretto, coffee and tonic of all things, keep watching on Let's Talk Drinks. Hi everybody, welcome back to the YouTube channel. Guys, please like, subscribe. I'm trying to build my YouTube channel up and I need your help. So I saw this recipe for this cocktail in a magazine here in Australia and I thought, wow, uh, I really need to try this. This was created by a bartender by the name of Kate McGraw in Sydney. It is called the Amaretto Ristretto and a few of the flavors I was wondered how it would go with tonic and haven't tried it yet, so let's see. I'm hoping I'm not filming this for nothing, Kate, but uh, I'm pretty sure you know what you're doing. Uh, I'm just gonna get stuck straight into it. I'm gonna build this cocktail in a rocks glass over ice. So I'm gonna put some ice in there. The first ingredient that we're going to use is amaretto. I like to use disarono. And it is 30 mils or one ounce. For those of you that don't know what Disarono is, it is an almond liqueur. Uh, it's actually not made from almonds. I'll have to watch out a video that I'm going to do really soon about amaretto. Second ingredient that we're going to do is 15 mils of a coffee liqueur. Of course, I'm going to use Mr. Black. 15 mils or half an ounce. Next up, 20 mils of a cold brew espresso. We like to use uh, our coffee from Coffee Cartel. This is an Ethiopian, uh, single origin. So just, you know, we've got a really nice uh, coffee liqueur there. I wanted to match it with a really nice coffee as well. I'm gonna top this up with tonic water. Really important though, if you're using tonic water in any drink, especially your G&Ts and stuff like this, use a quality tonic. I'm using Fever Tree. This is our house uh, tonic here at the 18th Amendment Bar. Well, at all of my venues. Give that a little bit of a stir. Really want to incorporate and make sure that that tonic gets through the whole cocktail. For the garnish was just a grapefruit twist. Really want to spritz those oils over the top of that cocktail. Okay, this is the Amaretto Ristretto Salud. Okay, <laughs> this works. I thought that I would get the Disarono uh, at the very start, but for me, I got the tonic water straight away the coffee and then I get this really nice rounding off uh, warming sort of flavor of the Disarono that's in there. Um, who would have known Kate? That's so good and actually the, the grapefruit twist on the top too it's giving those oils a little bit of that sort of grapefruit flavor to it. I would love to know why you decided to pick the grapefruit. I wouldn't have thought of that but it works perfectly. Um, well, wow, that's a good pick me up for the morning. Uh, this is something that would be great at home or for you bartenders uh, that work in venues. Just another sort of coffee cocktail that you can use as well. Um, twist on a gin and tonic. Um, love it. Uh, thanks for watching guys. See you again soon on Let's Talk Drinks. Don't forget to like it and subscribe. Cheers.